Okay, question number five. Todd is exactly six years older than Rita. If T represents Todd's age and R represents Rita's age, which of the following statements is always a true statement? So we'll do a little bit of setup first. T equals Todd and R equals Rita. So we have those letters set. I'm going to make a little table to help me organize the numbers here. So let me do this, this, and this. I hope that's long enough. This is Rita, and this is Todd. Let's go with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And using this formula that they give up here, Todd is six years older than Rita. So if Rita is one, Todd must be seven. If Rita is two, Todd is eight. Rita is three, Todd is nine, and so on down the line. I will fill it in. You can see the pattern. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. The question is, which of the following statements is always a true statement? Well. Looking at all these choices, they all have these symbols. Let's review these, the symbol or these symbols once before we look at the choices. Remember, this symbol is less than, and this symbol is greater than. So the first choice says, T is less than six. Todd is less than six years old. Well, not in any of these cases. So that's not always going to be true. Cross that one off. B, Rita is less than six years old. Well, she is here early on in the chart, but not here later in the chart. So that's not always going to be true. T is greater than R. Todd is greater than Rita. Todd is older than Rita. Will that always be true? Look at this table. Yeah, that seems, seems to always be true in this table. So we'll mark that one as a possible. Rita is greater than Todd. Rita is older than Todd. Is that the case here? No. Rita's never going to be older than Todd because the rule up top says Todd is older than Rita. So that can't be right. C is the correct answer.